Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to introduce you the all new BYD Song L. This is a new vehicle right now in the market. It's a full electric version. It has got two battery packs, 71 kilowatt or the 87 kilowatt. And the one I'm showing you is the performance edition. So if you choose the 87 kilowatt battery pack for the performance version, then the NADC range will be around 600 kilometers. And 0 to 100, it will take 4.3 seconds. But if you choose the 87 kilowatt battery pack for basic version, then the NADC range will be 662 kilometers and 0 to 100, it will take around 6.2 seconds. But also you can choose 71 kilowatt battery pack. Uh, if you choose 71 kilowatt battery pack, then the NADC range will be 550 kilometers. Look at the design language of this vehicle. If you see from the rear part, it looks pretty close to GKR001. It has got a functional spoiler. If you speed up around 60 km per hour, then the spoiler will be automatically open. So here we got a full tail lights over here. These are the same concept we used to see in other BYD lineup. Also, it has got a 360 degree camera, some parking sensors with the BYD logo. Let me open the cargo. So it's a hydraulic cargo. Here you will get 400 tail liter storage capacity at the back. If you don't the second row, then it will be around 1000 liter. And also we got two lights in your cargo. So if you open the cargo in a dark place, there is no problem at all. Also, we get some space over here for your tools. So as I mentioned, it's a hydraulic cargo. If you press it, it will be closed. Now, if we come to the this side, here, here is your charging port. So you will get two charging ports at the same place. If you use the slow charging port, then it will take uh, seven to eight hours to charge your battery. But if you use the fast charging port, then it will take 25 minutes. Now we are going to introduce the height and the length of the vehicle. So the height of the vehicle is 1.5 meter. The length is 4.8 meter and the wheelbase is 2.9 meter. Front wheel distance, 1.9 meter is around two meters and the rear wheel distance 1.9 meter. Ground clearance, it will be around 20 centimeter and it doesn't have the air suspension because the price is very reasonable. Now look, here we got 20 or 19 inch wheels with hand cooked tire. The tire size will be 265 by 45 R20. But if you want, you can choose the 19 inch as well. And also you can see the, see the wheels up so here they are using the basic brake it's not the berimbo one but it looks uh, great with the uh, vehicle now also we got the pop-up door handles these are not the electric doors and if we come to the front if we come to the front then here you can use your nfc card also you will get some cameras with your side mirror and look at the front first let me show you the front space we also got a little bit of space in the front here you can use maybe you can uh, carry some of your tools especially a small kind of bag it's around 45 to 50 liter so we used to see this kind of space in tesla model 3. so I really appreciate BYD because they always come up with some new design and they are not copied that at all. So look at the front, it looks amazing. Here we got a full dynamic light. This will be visible in day and night. Also it has got the LED headlight, LED high beam and the low beam. Here we got a 360 degree camera, also grill in the front but this is not functional because the vehicle is a full electric version. Now look at here, here it got some space. So the air will flow from this way. The drug coefficient of this vehicle is 0.25 CD around. So it will give you a better aerodynamic performance. Now, we are going to show you the interior. We don't have much space because, you know, Guanyin. Guanyin means Chinese New Year. Uh, so there is just one vehicle available in this store. So we have to show you like this way. First, look at the color combination of the interior. It looks amazing. It goes with the white and black color combination. It looks great. So all seats are electric seat. Here it got the napa leather, but there is no alcantara materials. So look, you can trace here. 
to make it more comfortable. Also, you can move the seats like this way. You can also do it for, through the screen. And here is another button. So that's pretty well. Now let me introduce the interior. So the interior looks great. It it has got some new design language. Uh, we used to see this kind of pad in the previous of BYD all the vehicles line up and also it can be rotated we used to see in BYD Han first time uh, this kind of concept and then it goes with all the other vehicles so it's the pretty similar so what's new in the interior look here it has got a new design and the gear knob is completely you know different so it looks pretty pretty stylish and also we got one, two, three, four, four S events at the middle. Here is your wallet charger. And there are some switches over here. So you can change the mode through this button. And it has got three modes, normally co sport. Here is your hazard button. And also you can increase and decrease the volume through this one. Also, we got two cup holders. And here is a small box with your armrest. We got previous leather in the dashboard. Here is your auto hood. And you can even, uh, you know, adjust your auto hood. That is a good side. Also, we got some chromes all over in the body and chassis, also in the inside the interior, which looks great. There is a compartment box. And if we come close, come close here, we let me show you some stuff. So these all are the same concept we used to see in, you know, uh, in other vehicles, oh, sorry. I mean, uh, it's the same con concept uh, they are using here. Also, is uh, the link, the pilot, and all the functions. So this pad, you can change the light of the vehicle. You can even activate your seat heating, seat masses, and also you can, you know, you can change the slide through the pad and here are some functions these are all showing in uh, chinese but for global market you can always you can of course you will get it in english so there is no problem at all so these are the same functions uh we used to see in other lineup as well so there is no change at all here we got a small you know screen here you can see the any any this range of the vehicle and also the speed of the vehicle we can see it through the auto hood and we got a leather steering wheels which is adjustable so you can adjust it like this way also here are some switches you can receive your phone call through this button also here is a robot over here so you can uh command command here so what else we got oh you also got some buttons cruise controller over here and look so here you can increase and decrease your volumes and you can also do it through this button so it's pretty similar also we got here is a camera so we used to see this kind of camera in avatar uh 12 avatar 11 so these are basically maybe you are driving the vehicles you are not focusing on your driving then it will help you to shake your steering wheel it's a wake-up call it was just like hey you have to focus in on your driving that's a good a good design now we used to see this kind of concept in uh, all new upcoming vehicles here we got a light with your mirror also we got two lights over here and a camera at this part so there is a big sunroof you can't open it but it will give you a great feelings we got many earbags uh through the uh, interior so also you see here is the light so especially this will make so colorful especially at night so it can help you to make your interior more colorful we got many chromes all over the body and chassis looks great as i mentioned it these all are the napa leathers uh, but there is no alcantara material because the price really matter so we are going to check out the second row of the vehicle
so let's check out the second row of the vehicle the color combination it looks great the black and white color combination always looks great but it's easy to get dirty so you can choose you know different interior color as well so there is no problem at all so i got enough leg space enough head space as i mentioned it has got a big panoramic sunroof, sunroof which looks great also got some got some new design over here we got one two three four s events in the middle and from you can activate these seat heating seat muscles through these buttons also you can control the front seat like this way so this is also a good side and this all are electric seat so you can activate your seat heating seat muscles here we got two cup holders with your armrest and also we got some lights at the top part of the uh, the vehicle these are not Alc uh, alcantara materials these are very you know basic materials they have used because price really matter when you uh, uh, they use napa and alcantara so here we also got some lights this will help you to make your interior more colorful at night so that's pretty all and we got a switch over here these are not electric doors but you can press then you have to open it let me tell you the price of the vehicle it goes with 180k to 240k chinese rmb which is around 30 to 35 thousand us dollar as i mentioned it before it has got two battery packs 71 kilowatt or 87 kilowatt the NADC range will be around 550 to 662 kilometers. Geo 200, the performance version, it will take 4.3 seconds, and the basic version, it will take around 8.3 seconds. And the price, 30 to 35,000 US dollar. I think that it's a good vehicle. It looks great, especially, you know, BYD always come up with some new design, and they often try their best to give us the good vehicle with the reasonable price so this will be a big competitor of jilker 001 keep supporting me do subscribe my channel until then bye bye